How far away is Mars from the Sun? How about the diameter of Jupiter? Or the distance to the Milky Way? Each of these distances can use a different unit of measure when measuring in space. Welcome to Moomoo Math and Science. In this video, let's take a look at the kilometer, the astronomical unit, and the distance of a light year. Let's start with planet characteristics. The planet characteristics, like diameter, can be measured using a kilometer. A kilometer is equal to 1,000 meters. Interesting fact, a meter originally was the distance of one-tenth millionth of the distance from the equator to the North Pole. Now it is the length that light travels in a vacuum in roughly one three-hundred millionth of a second. Not really sure exactly how they calculate that, but that's the distance. A meter is about the length of your arm. Here's the chart of the diameter of the planets using kilometers. Another way that you can measure distance in space is by using an astronomical unit. It is most frequently used to measure the distance from the sun to a planet. It is the average distance from the sun to the earth, and it's approximately 150 million kilometers. Here's a chart of all the planets and their distance in AU from the Sun. The stars are so far away, a new unit of measure, the light year, was created to measure these extreme distances. A light year is a unit of measure equal to the distance light travels in one year. One light year is equal to 9.46 trillion kilometers. The furthest objects we can observe are more than 10 billion light years away. Polaris, or the North Star, is 430 light years away. And the Milky Way galaxy, the center of it, is 26,000 light years away. Thanks for watching, and remember, kindness multiplies kindness. Be kind to someone today.